88 films. It's kind of cooked. 200 bucks. Can't beat it. Most overrated shoe in my opinion. My opinion. Keyword, my opinion. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Just drop this today. Well, it's online now. For you guys viewing this. Cindy, Gucci. All right, we got new merch. Again, but it's not coming out for a bit. Oh. Let me, let me, let me put, put it on. You gotta put it on, you gotta put it on. Yeah, but let me put it on, man. And we got sweatpants too. <laughs> but once upon a time ago, Jordan used to go do good packs, really good packs. Did they slip? That were 310 retail, I believe. This one might have been cheaper. 125 now. Got a lot of uh, stuff that came in last night. Couldn't picture it, so I'll picture it in the morning. Available today. We have some pretty good stuff. Stone Cold Vintage Tea, 80 bucks. Hangover Tea, which is funny, it's crazy. We're getting old. Hangover, Rob didn't believe that it was vintage, but 2009, it's right at, at the edge. 80 bucks, cool tea. Steel of the post is the 36 Mafia Tea, size large for 150 going out. You guys missed out, I'm sorry. Supreme, Gucci tee, 50 bucks. That Aerosmith is really, really good. Um, some Cortez, some Stone Island Cargos. But yeah, a lot of good stuff has been coming through the shop, so we'll show you guys in a bit. All right, we're back. Show you guys around the store. First post, we just dropped this today. Well, it's online now for you guys viewing this. Cindy, Gucci, You're the Dragon. Um, the hoodie. And the hoodie's all embroidered. Ooh. Everything. Let's go. Cool. So if you guys want to know, a lot of people are like, oh, it's here's the dragon, blah, 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 blah. But no, so this is um, Gucci Chuck Taylor's from the, with the dragon on the side. Pusha T set that in the grinding song back, back in the day. So that was the whole concept behind this whole thing. It was literally a bar by Pusha T. Gucci Chuck Taylor with the dragon on the side. Man, I make a buck while I scram. I'm trying to show y'all who the fuck I am. But luckily for us, you're the dragon this year. So, kind of cool. Goes obviously with the Chinatown theme, us being in Chinatown and them being big supporters of us and us being big supporters of them. But yeah, online now. Get it? Um, a lot of crazy stuff has been coming by the store low key. All right, like look at this, Travis. Looks brand new. Like, come on. 1350, so you get like 300 bucks. Base size, size six. 650, pretty clean. Off by Chicago ones. Ten and a half. Yours. You know, funny story, this used to be mine. Ooh. Used to be mine. I traded this in a big deal where I ended up getting my Sonic Youth tea, the bunny tea that everybody always asks me about. So it's funny how the, the guy that sold it to us is like, I haven't worn it since we did that big trade. So these were originally mine and I got these on Wall Street when they dropped, when I first moved to New York. Funny story. UNC's. And then you obviously have like Lost and Bounds at a better price, Black Toast, this, this. Cause Force, 1500, still very clean. Saves you like at least 500 bucks. Supreme Fives. For the big dudes, size 12, 400. I don't think you can find it any cheaper than that. Super clean, MCA, size 11, 1400. Um, Kobe's, 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 Kobe's. So yeah, some really good stuff. Um, vintage, you know, we're always doing really well with the vintage. Dream Team. So you guys can always find something very good in there. Don't squeeze the juice. OJ Simpson. Damn. Crazy. It's funny, I um 
I seen this documentary, The Made in America. If you guys haven't watched that, it's a ESPN documentary, I believe. It's really good. Alright. So we got some crazy stuff in this week. First, Mr. Cartoon Air Force One with the spider web. Honestly, keeping it a buck, we were gonna sell it. We were, not for sale, for $8.50. But then we're like, we're probably never gonna see it for a while. So if we get another one, we'll sell it. But as of now, not for sale. Then obviously you have the one that is for sale for six fifty. dollars So yeah, biggest differences right there. Both fire. Then this. Wait, is that? It's a P. Howard. Oh. HBC, SBCU. I forgot how to say it, but yeah. Completely butchered it. Yeah. But P, size 12, good size. I think fair price from what I saw online, 3,000. A lot of pairs start at 38. I think 3,000 is fair, really good material. Um, honestly, wild take, this is better than the SoFly Jordan one that's gonna come out. I think this looks better. Um, but yeah, we've been getting a ton of stuff in, you know. We have two, where they are, where they are, right here. Something you don't see every day. But before I go there, the what the? What the dunk. college? College dunk. Yeah. What the college? So this, I remember it came out a while ago. I think I believe it was Japan exclusive. They were sitting on GOAT for super cheap, super, super, super cheap. Nobody wanted dunks at the time. 200 bucks? 300? Like 250. My homie Thibaut from Paris, shout out Thibaut. He's taking care of me very well. He asked me, can you find me a pair? And I was just like, yeah, I'm not even going to hunt. Spot on GOAT for him. And he blessed me so much that I gave it to him for free and I bought myself a pair. And then Dima, I think, still has my pair. But now they're going for 550. I think they should be going for more, but they're only going for 550 because kind of we were getting over dunks. But really made made well, good materials, looks good. Um, speaking of looks good, honestly, what the clocks? Another what the? The other shoe's better, but it's in the box. But honestly, 350 for I would say a really really nice shoe. It's not bad. That one came out two years ago. No, like last year. Oh, last. Year. Last year before they ended their contract with Nike. What else is in here? Oh, something you don't see every day. Weed your dunks. 500. Pretty good price for PS. And the vapors. Vapor dunks, SBs, DS. 700. I overpriced it a bit just to have it sitting. Maybe you want to bring trades right here, but. I mean, I think 700, it's a fair price for what it is. These, I believe, correct me if I'm wrong, used to be worth this. I mean, they were, I'm kidding, I know that. Um, but yeah, some pretty good stuff on this side. Let's see if we have anything cool for you guys over here. Ah, uh, we always do. Oh, right here. Think 16, Kawhi Leonard. Funny story about these. They came out, everybody had them in New York. Our good friend Lambo Pretty. Shout out Lambo. He sold us a ton of pairs at round two for 350 a pop. No cap. Oh, but y'all sold them for 1600 No, we didn't. We put them up for 450 to 500 But they went up, they shot up because obviously, if you guys know, Kawhi tried to get this emblem when he was leaving Jordan and Jordan and Nike won. They kept, this is a really good logo, by the way. One of the better logos, the KL. The claw. The claw. But yeah, shout out Kawhi. UNC3s, 550, brand new. You don't see that every day. And then something that I kind of want, but again, 10 and a half, brand new, white cement, four. I always give it like a week before I grab something. It was funny, I saw somebody commented because I was wearing my Cortez 95 yesterday and we sold the Cortez 95 yesterday for 700. It sold, 
um, somebody was just like, oh, so it was the owner that ended up taking that 95. Like, hey, buddy, I wait a week. I, I do wait a week, but yeah, I usually wait a week before I grab something from in-store, kind of give the customers first come, first serve. But yeah, they were like complaining on the comments that because they saw me on the reel wearing my Cortez 95. But if you look at our story, I saw, I posted the 95 with my, on foot. But yeah, that's usually my, my personal rule for me, wait a week. And if it sits, it's meant to be, if it's not. Like today, big one, hopefully it sits. This one, no cap, I'm not giving it a week. I lied. $1,000, but if nobody lines up for this, I'm gonna take it. But I'm pretty sure somebody will line up. Brand new, size 10. What do you guys think of this? Where does this rank? I think it's my best off-white Jordan. That's my opinion. Those uh, Cortezes you got them at daily, no? Yeah, okay. So and you got those at daily. So trip up. I got them at daily and you were there. You guys saw it. Dima never really bugs me for shoes and he hit me up bugging crazy. Like, hey, I need those, blah, blah, blah. They're hard to find. It's a 95, bro. You don't really wear 95s. <laughs> Literally typical, you know, like he was like, you know, he really wanted to shoot. <laughs> so I tell him like, look, bro, I'll give it to you. Bless them, free, no charge. Gave it to him. I ended up finding another pair for a really, really good price, a little under what I paid for the DS pair, but it was super clean. And the day that I got it, a fucking another one walked in. So what are the odds? What what in the yeah? What in the Doctor Strange is happening? But yeah, that's what happened. We sold it. We actually shipped it because a couple people came to line up for it, and they both tried it on. They run small, and they're like, "Oh, I can't fit it." They didn't force it. We give it the first 30 minutes and obviously you guys can DM us if you guys see anything and we'll ship it out to you. Shout out to the homie the cop. What's up, bro? How much you want? Oh, they're kind of rare, but they're kind of beat up, so... Hey, bro. <laughs> kind of beat up is kind of crazy, crazy statement. Sort of mad cook. I could have ran through like my ex, you know? So, how much do you need? Straight up, bro, like at least five bucks. Dude. You're sure a mad cook, bro. How about credit? Can you get 50 credit? Credit? I'll give you 100 credit. Oh, okay. Just because I like it, bro. I'll look Gotcha. I remember one time, I went on a date, right? And uh, long story short, it, 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 funny story though, funny story about these breads. I went on a date, right? And I picked these up from Offer Up. And uh, it was my last, I forgot how much I paid. I think it was like 250. It was 250. And uh, this girl wanted to go get yogurt land. Forgot my wallet. I was wondering if you could do a straight trade. Straight trade? No, I'm good. Straight trade. What do you think, bro? Straight trade for that? Uh, I'll take the five. You want to take the five? Yeah. Got you. Look, check it out. Only because we're in a recession, I got you on gold coins. All right? 2020. All right, look. A little, little extra, a little extra for you. All right? I'm here for the people, bro. Because I've been in that side, dude. I've been in that side where you literally come and they lowball you. You got to hook it up. Uh, this is going to be on... This is gonna be available now, right? Yeah. Lincoln bio, new Cindy, where someone says Cinchi. Oh no way. Or something like that. Yeah, yesterday, you know what the coolest thing was? It was like this kid that you know, I don't really see, but he comes around. But it's like, he's on the phone with his homies and they're like, you could hear him say like, where you at? And he's just like, oh, I'm at Cindy, fool. And I was just like, in my head, I'm like, oh, it's fire. Like, just like, everybody. like you, like, you, Cindy, you know. You gotta know what it is at this point. Yeah, that was cool. That was like a little like, that was like. <laughs> Sounds like you with the girl. That was a little victory right Sounds like you're, oh, I'm at Cindy. With Cindy. I don't know, maybe not. See, but I get it, but then if his homie understands where he's at by just saying Cindy, it's like that's tight that they know, like, oh, I'm at Cindy. Like, I'm at Cindy. Your street slang. Yeah, yeah street slang. Street slang. ¿Dónde vienes? De Guatemala. De Guatemala. ¿Y cómo escuchaste de la tienda? Ah, pues un amigo. Simón, ¿y qué es lo que estás buscando? Ah, Jordan 1. 
¿Jordan 1? Yeah. ¿En qué medida? Ah, hey. pues, Jordan 8, 8 y medio. Ah, Simón, Simón. Yeah. Ahí tenemos varios, ¿eh? Ok, están varas. Hey, ahí estamos. Okay. All right, so yesterday we got blessed by one of our homegirls, Sam, with Adidas. Uh, she told us to give these away. Uh, so she gave us like four shoes, I think. That's one, consortium. Um, and another one, high top, low top. And it was funny because, you know, we always do giveaways, but we gave out one size eight and three size fives, and all the kids from the neighborhoods ran in, and one of them came in and he was a size eight, gave it to him. But it was just free, no push-ups, nothing. Then like four of them came, and they tried to get this, and I'm like, bro, you ain't a size five, blah, 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 so I denied it. Right now, a girl actually came and picked one up, so yeah, so these must be your size. Cause they're free, no push-ups, no nothing. Literally, you just come in and where else can you just walk in and take a shoe? Unless you're the old round to employee. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Hi, Briss. What do you bring? Possibly working out a big trade. We'll let you guys know, see what he thinks. Straight trade or no. cash on top? He might have more. We'll see. I'll let you guys know in a bit. They are 11. So if you don't know what this is, this is uh, green lobster. I'm not gonna lie, when these uh, dropped, I was kind of disappointed with their special packaging just because the red and blue have really good pack, like special packaging. The red one came with like a lunch bag and inside it was like the crate and a bunch of like extras. The blue one came in the foam like crate. It had like the foam finger and a bunch of other stuff too. And this is just like a weird little lunch box. But to the shoes. Green lobster. I don't know why these don't get a lot of love. I, I think it's a good one. Um, oh, it's $2,000, I'm sure it gets a lot of love. <laughs> no, but nonetheless, like, rank as far as, like, which ones are the better ones. Like, <laughs> it better get some love, it's too bad. I think this is, like, a really good colorway, in my opinion. I don't know what the rarity of the lobster is, but. Yeah. That one was one. more limited than the other one. What was the other one that came out? Purple. The purple. purple. This one was supposed to be more than Yeah. The real question is, where is your yellow lobster? Somewhere in China. He sold it for the price of that. Right? Yeah, literally. <laughs> he literally sold it for I the have price got, of that. I have got the yellow lobster when it was DS at Flight Club for three thousand or something like that. And you sold it for two? I sold it for eight. No, I had it for two. I wore it for like about a year, but they're like mad clean still. I didn't wear them that much. And then I don't know. I got. I I would get over shoes really quick. I still do. And then um, about a year later, I bring them in one day to round two, and I put them out for sale for two thousand. And there's this customer that would always come in, like she was a like, very like loyal customer of ours. We called her Mimi, because that's where she would go by. And she asked me, she's like, hey, for, can you do like a better price for me? She's like, 1800? I was like, you know what, fine for you. But again, this is still when they're going for like 3.5 most. And now? And she bought them. And then Travi wore them like maybe six months later. And they were, and I asked her, I'm like, hey, I'm like, by any chance, do you still have that shoe? She's like, I sent it to China as soon as I bought it. So, whoever has it out there in China, size 11, enjoy them. All right, we got new merch again, but it's not coming out for a bit. February or March? February. I don't know, maybe next week, fuck it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, today. Stitch. It's not Stitch, it's Max. And Willie. <laughs> <laughs> Put together. If you know, you know. If you know, you know the reference. Bad dog. Oh, look. No one said it'll cook, but. My pair is hot. My pair is hot. And we got sweatpants too. I thought this was you. The little flames. Hot. 
there's still another piece missing to this whole collection, so we can't really see it. A hoodie? Uh, long sleeve. Just fucking, huh? Where are the jeans? Double X? Raw dog? Fucking bad. What size is that? XL. XL. You don't need to know, bro. Oh, Freak. Freakathon. Straight rap. So you guys can see. Damn! Get up in there! What? Oh! Okay. You got a little sneaky link in the night, you feel me? <laughs> bro, this song? I wish we had the long sleeve so you could just picture it all at once right now. But we don't. Does it get a back end? Yeah. Ooh. May the 4th? No, bro, that's like in May. I'm <laughs> kidding, I'm kidding. Valentine's Day. Homie Casey pulled up. He's been a supporter of us. I told him that I want to bless him with one of these. Can you give it to him, Chan? Hi, Casey. Got a little gift for you from the big man. You are the ambassador of Chinatown. So she's gonna be on the right side. Oh, let me let me let me put, put it on. You gotta put it on. You gotta put it on. Yeah, but let me put it on, man. You put a little dragon there. You know, yeah. you're the dragon. What do you think, Casey? Chris said because you're the ambassador of Chinatown, we gotta give you one. So. Yeah. Help me. Oh. Help me. Come on, Ronald. Come on. There you go. There you go. Does that fit good or you need a bigger one? Help me a little bit because I, I, I felt down the other day. No, this is just perfect. That's good? Yeah. Put a little dragon on the back. On the front, sorry. Good. Oversized hoodie. Yeah. Yeah. That's good. There you go, Casey. We got you. time ago Jordan used to go do good packs really good packs did they slip? they were 310 retail I believe this one might have been cheaper if I correct me I know this one was a little cheaper um, but the counter packs were 310 you got two good packs I remember telling my little brother let's split it I need the breads I want to sell them bro you get the lucky greens but yeah DS pack I'm selling it as the pack just because I don't know, I think it's cool. Yeah, what if and I if somebody them? really wants this, should enjoy the Money entire pack. Yeah, but yeah this is great. Like, brand new, not yellow, nothing. <laughs> and they hit it with the jump end? Jump yeah, end? Jump yeah, end. What year was this? 2008, I believe. 2009, I lied. But, yeah, you get the whole pack for 500. And the box. And the box. Did they hurt to break in or not? Really good, I think. A great price, I believe. But yeah, hopefully, a lot of people have inquired about it, so it might sell by by the time this airs. Uh, Yo, did I, did I sell these? I got some meters. They've been sitting in my closet for a bit, but let me re-offer them. How much do you need? Um, honestly, I was looking online. They kind of move for a steady like two ball. I'll take like one fifty, you make fifty profit. Um. I'll give you like 10 cash, bro. I'll be honest with you, they're a mad beat. Uh, what, what would I get on credit? No credit, just straight cash, bro. They're pretty clean, though. Mm -hmm. You still wear them. I can see you wearing them. You want to offer yes or no, bro? Simple. Yeah, I'll take off, bro. All right, I'll cool. Off. I'm in bad times right now. Uh, bro. Shit, dude. <laughs> you just see my credit card statements, bro. The shits are maxed out. Y'all think I'm lying too. Shit. Yo. Yeah, I'm 
Yeah. What, bro? Paid, bro? Hey, bro, don't worry about it. These are mine now, all right? Got you on a roll, King. Don't spend it too much. I'll make hey, it bro. Thank you, handle, bro. bro. Handle. Thank you. Yeah. All right. Another sneaker take, I would say. I don't know. Who remembers these? I still think it's a great shoe. Oh, I'm sorry. So these came out, Complex Con. They were known as F&F a couple years ago. A long time ago, almost six years ago. Almost. They used to go for two bands. 1500, 1200, two bands. I've seen them all over the place. I had a pair that I got, I was blessed with. A little bird told me they're gonna come out again. Who's the bird, bro? And I was just like, are you sure? Same colorway, you know, you guys always do the whole like, oh, it's coming out, but it doesn't come out. She was like, yes, confirmed. Super out, like super GR. Super available. Super available. I sold it for 900 used around to New York City. I'm sorry, whoever bought it. 125 now. I did tell a good friend of mine that had a used pair to sell his too. Didn't listen to me. He lost. I ain't gonna lie, you're wearing the same. Oh no, you're not. <laughs> <laughs> like, comment, subscribe. <laughs> and you're trying to shine, King. Push on time. All right, we got Warren Lotus. Or no, Billy Hill. 30 push ups. Yeah, that's pretty good. Right here, 30 push ups, 30 piece. Clean ones. Can you show me how to do it first? Can you give him a, give, give him a little. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. You got it. One, two, three, four, five, 29. 30. Those are good fish. Okay. There you go. Can you just hold it up real quick? Let me take a pic. Let me take a pic. Let the people know it's been clean. Right. What's good, guys? Where are you guys from? Really from, from Maryland. Nice. Yeah, what we'll brought you guys in today? Came to browse through, see what you guys got going on. Yeah, nice. definitely like a nice store. I was like browsing through, we seen like a couple things hit. We're only 20 minutes away, so we're like, oh, let's stop in, see if we can grab something. And what'd you guys get? Uh, definitely got me a nice pair, of damn near brand new. I'm saying these storms definitely get Air Jordan ones. Nice, for sure, man. Thanks for coming by, bro. Appreciate, yeah, appreciate that. You. Thank you, bro. Yes, sir, yes, sir.
thank you for coming. I thank you for coming. And then I'll say bye. Thank you for coming, y'all. Thursday night, beautiful night. Matt's being crazy. I'm here with his loose. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Turn the notifications on. Peace. Los Angeles. Another early morning. You guys can come on in. Why not? That's me with the uh, super sun. Oh, we're in there. Yeah. yeah. Hi, right, Briss. How's it been today? All right, it's been just like me. Mid. It's very slow. People, once it rains, stay inside. Nice little cozy houses, but I don't mind it. We got this though, we got some steals. We got some good prices. Nothing, oh my God, but some pretty good stuff at the best prices. It's kind of cooked. 200 bucks, can't beat it. Going out now, see who cops. We just had a little mishap. Some guy couldn't, uh, I'm not even gonna get into it. But yeah. Get from 200. All right, Max. So the question of the day: What Talk is the most overrated shoe in the store and the most underrated shoe in the store? The most overrated shoe, in my opinion. My opinion. Keyword: My opinion. Okay. This is me. My opinion. It's gonna be the Powerpuff SBs. I don't what? like the color. I just don't like it. I just don't like it. I don't. Overrated. Over for the overrated. Overrated. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Ooh. You see, I'm dyslexic, my bad. It's kind of, it's gonna be the, the Supreme Dunks, but not the highs, the lows. The lows. The lows, I had my pair, I beat them to the dirt. I took them to the gym, I took them in the mud, I took them to the grass, I took them everywhere. If I get them back, I would, but that's the most underrated shoe that I like. The Supremes. My most overrated shoe, it's gotta be this. It's just I don't get the price. I don't get it. I'm sorry for the Kawhi, Kawhi folks, but not for me. Most underrated. People hate on these. Yeah, I'm a truck driver. Some people do. Oh yeah, you are. I like them. I love it. That was just like a quick off the top of my head, so I might just have to think a little bit more. Get back to y'all. All right, for overrated, I have two. Don't do it. 150 for credit or 100 It's going to be this shit right here. I think this, since the drop, it's been overrated in my opinion. No problem. And, please. I think both of these shoes are very, very, very overrated, in my opinion. And then sticking with the uh, with the ones, I think this shoe is very underrated. As you can tell. I think people got too caught up with the woven. And they're just like, oh, I don't know. But every single person that's tried it on and bought it or whatever, they're like, you know what, I love it. This shoe's definitely underrated in my opinion. Yeah, way too cheap for what it is. All right, so I gotta pick my uh, overrated and uh, underrated shoe. So for overrated, I saw Matt choose this one. So I'm gonna just throw it as a contender. This shoe, I'm not a fan of. I don't understand why it goes for that. And then, since Matt already chose that one, I'm gonna go and do these. It's, it's too shiny. I don't. I, who, why is there so much glitter on it? Oh yeah. On these, but this is my most overrated shoe. Here. And then underrated, I'm gonna go for. Where'd it go? Oh, right here. This is just a very uh, chew that I like a lot. So I'm gonna go with these for underrated. I'll be trying to sell it to people in here and they're like, oh, it's too much. But I love these and it has a fat tongue. So it makes it even better. But yeah, those, those are my choices. I'm 
No mames. Hey, wait, where'd you get this Salvation Perfect. Army? Bro, wait, what's up with it's this? Vintage, this is this a, a rag? It's, it's autographed, bro. Rag, look, they're trying to sell a rag. <laughs> no, bro, no. Mira, wait, mira, wait. Get the second one. You go get better stuff over there, bro. What you? What else you got though? Let me check those out. I want to trade for this. You want to trade yeah, on, this for that? Get up. I'm always here. I don't care. I'm here every day. They don't hook me up. Come on, bro. What's your best? What's your best offer for this? For what? This for this, bro. Bro, it's, it's, I'm, vintage, bro. it's back in style. Come look, on. bro. It's trendy. No, bro. I can't. Why can't you, bro? Get the look. Uh, how about how, how about this? Look. How about this? Bring me a Big Mac with extra large fries and a six-piece nugget. You got yourself a deal. Come on, bro. I'm got hey, bro. Uh, easy, easy. Postmates it. Hey, what? You know what? Here, bro. Take this back. Take this stuff back. Hey, would you? Oh my God, it's nasty. I need to wash my hands for that. Can you believe that? Shit. Who wanted an MCA? Fucking. Uh, come on, right? come on. I don't know if I can say that on YouTube. Come on. All right, we're back. George Kittle touchdown. I'm sick. Whatever. What is it? Bang, whatever. What is it? Bang, bang, Niner Gang. Bang, bang, Niner Gang, I guess. <laughs> to you guys. <laughs> Shout out to Homie Fernie. Shout out to Homie Fernie. Here you watch this. <laughs> All right, it's a slow day. Right, like I said, we didn't get. Oh my god products, but we got some decent product. A lot of well-priced solid sneakers. But you know on a slow day you take the really good stuff. Born and race. Brand new, ten and a half, very rare. And Slowly making the climb. Hold on. Size 12, 800. Just because of the 12, though. We sold size 9 for 400 the other day. But double. But yeah, take the good, take the, put the bad. We got good product this week. So, you know, slow day. What? What up guys, I'm back again. Two Sundays, I mean two Saturdays back to back. Had to get my boy Juan in the mix. Juan, let the people know who you are. I'm Juan. Hey, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and follow. And if you're a hooper, get at him. He hoops for uh, Drew, Drew Lee. Drew Lee. <laughs> catch, catch him. My